Team Salufo, 4 and 1, fighting as a lightweight. So we're going to have ourselves a great lightweight match at the Steel City Rumble 5. Steel City Rumble 5 brought to you by BMF Fightwear, as well as California Mixed Martial Arts. Sanctioned by Kick International All Martial Arts. Go to www.kickinternational.com for all sanctioned events by Kick International All Martial Arts. Sal Woods is going to be your referee for this third match of the night. Elvin Spahich coming from CMMA, California Mixed Martial Arts, 2-1, also fighting from 155. And Mark, I love watching lightweights go at it. They're, they're just so explosive and just so beautiful. Elvis Spahich wearing the tap-out shorts. Adam Flowers in the short. Yes. Adam Flowers, such a great job by Spahik. Adam Flowers trying to throw some haymakers. Dice sprawl from Elvin. Flowers does a great job sprawling. He's being pushed, though, pretty heavily by Elvin Spahik. Nice, Elvin. Nice, Elvin. Now walk around the pin. not in a good position. Flowers having that top control. Yeah, Able Flowers. Trying to do a good job. And man, we are seeing Flowers do a great job. Of sprawling, Andy. Yes, yes, we are. Flowers doing a very good job of fighting the takedowns. Except for that one, Flowers. I'm sorry, Spahich finally gets a takedown by a double leg. He's got him in a guillotine. He's got him hard in a guillotine. He's going to try to wrench that up. And if he can get it wrenched in strong enough, he's going to get this guy to tap. No, he let go of the guillotine. Elvin did a very good job of breaking his hands. Flowers and Elvin, both of them doing a very good job of staying poised and staying relaxed. And Elvin just goes into a full mount. He's going to be able to pop his head out very easily. If he gets that head out, this is going to be bad. There he is, Flowers, full mount. That's exactly what we got, Andy. He's got a very high full mount right now, too. Uh, Flowers trying to keep him in, trying to push him down, but these lefts and rights by, by Elvin Spahich. Great job for the ground and pound. It looks like Flowers, if you can see the two legs of Spahich, controlling Flowers, not allowing him. He wanted to try to creep out the back. It, yeah, it's very possible, and I'll tell you, Flowers... If Flowers rolls over, he's going to give his back up, and I don't think Spahich is going to be the kind to let a rear naked choke slip out of his grasp. Oh, nice armbar! Nice was flow to an armbar. Beautiful flow to an armbar by Adam Flowers, but Flowers is going to use some rabbit punches, some chest punches, and he's able to break it. Great job, though, by Adam Flower, by Elwin to bring up to that armbar. And oh, now he's, he's going got for an omoplata. He's going for an omoplata. He's got the yes, omoplata. Uh, Flowers doing a very nice job. He's trying to get that omoplata, Andy. If he can get that omoplata locked in, this could be bad for Adam Flowers. Yeah, but Flowers doing a very, very good job of preventing it. And look at this. Flowers just picking him up and throwing him. But he's going to roll him back into an armbar. He rolls it back into an armbar. And if he doesn't get that, he goes right to the omoplata. This is unbelievable, Andy. Great action. Spahich doing an excellent job of going from submission to submission to submission. Wow. Spahech is really impressing us here at the Steel City Rumble. Work him, work him, work him. Work him, work him. You hear Elvin Spahech's corner yelling out, work him, work him, work him. What they're talking about is trying to tell, tell him to take that left hand of Spahech and just punch it right into the left side of Flowers. Ten seconds left in the round. And he's got that arm wrapped around the back. Adam Flowers, not in a bad position, but if he wrenches it too hard, he could actually make him tap. And wow, Adam Flowers completely saved by the bell in this first round, Andy. Flowers did an excellent job of preventing himself from tapping. And Mark, I, first round goes to Spy Hitch, totally without goes a doubt. To Spy Hitch. It was a beautiful, watch the replay. Yeah, There's he, a couple of nice ground and pound shots right there. That was almost a flying arm bar in Mark A. It was just such a beautiful attempt. What do you think Adam Flowers is going to have to do in the second round, Andy? Uh, well, Mark, I'm going to say he's going to have to keep it standing up. Spot Hedge versus Flowers, second round action. Let's see if Flowers can keep this fight standing up. We're seeing some great, great fighting between these two competitors. As you said, the lightweights nice don't deserve Spot Hitch with a nice switch kick to the stomach. Of Flowers, Flowers keeps it, is going to have to keep it standing, and there he goes again. And wow, oh, good no. takedown by Spahich. 
This is bad, bad news. See, this is bad news for Adam Flowers. He obviously, you know, his ground game needs some work, man. Spot Hitch was able to put on arm bar after Alma Plata after arm bar. And, and it was just, it was absolutely beautiful to watch in the first round. Very reminiscent of the first round. We have Adam Flowers trying to put Spot Hitch into a guillotine and wrench it. But of course, Spot Hitch pulls right out just like the first round. Yeah. Right now, right now, Spot Hitch is, is in a full guard, but Flowers has a very weak full guard on right now. Yeah, it's a very weak full guard. He's going to be able to float here in a second. You can tell him there he goes. Nice. He floats right there. Right into side control. This is a great position. And right into a full mount. Wow, this guy, this guy is floating all over Adam Flowers. And I'll tell you, Flowers is keeping his arms up, and that's, you know, Flowers trying to buck him off and keeping him down low to prevent him from, from really posturing up and, and punching him just like he's doing now. Great job by Adam Flowers trying to keep him close. As you can see, wraps those arms real quickly, keeps him close because he knows he's not in a good position. He's got a really, really high mount on Flowers, and now he's gonna just keep doing it round and pound. He's gotta watch the back of the head, though. Gotta watch Spot the back of those shots, the back of the head shots. Sal Woods almost, almost ready to stop it. Uh, Flowers got a couple back of the head shots, but. The only way this could okay. be to better, to Spot Hitch is better, uh, better situation for Spot Hitch was if he had him against the cage. He had that control issue. Yeah. And he almost gave his back. Flowers, Flowers did give up his back. back. Flowers gave it back. He's got a rear naked. That's it. That's it. Flowers got the two on one, but he's had. That's it. That's it. Oh, great Adam job, Flowers. Spot Hitch. Adam Flowers had no choice but to tap right there. Great job by Spot Hitch to take out Adam Flowers. Spot Hitch with the floats in the first round. Second round gives the rear naked choke, sinks it in hard. Team Lufo is going to have to take a loss tonight. Unfortunately, CMMA is going to take a win. But these guys really, they fought their heart out.